Oh my gosh, it's so beautiful. I've always wanted to see the town lit up at night like this. It is a sight to see. Never thought a view like this was in my own backyard. You know, it's crazy how we met up out of nowhere. Especially after all this time. Yeah, tell me about it. You know, I would watch you all the time from my hospital room. Wait, watch me doing what? Well, at first, I only heard your voice. You were really loud, so that's what initially got my attention. Give me back my change, or meat you still eating. <laughs> I would hear that kind of thing every day. Yeah, that does sound a lot like me. At first, I wasn't sure what to think of you, but I warmed up to you pretty quick. Instead of lying around in bed wondering whether I'd live or die, I had someone else to focus on. Whenever you were in short sleeves, I knew it was summer. Or when you wore a scarf, I knew it was winter. Really? Damn, if I'd known I was being watched, I would have worn cooler stuff. No. What you wore was perfect. It reflected the true you, Kasuka-san. The man I fell in love with. Huh? You serious? Oh, hold on, hold on. Did I hear you right? You love me? <laughs> I hope that's not a problem. Hey, Kasuka-san? Live long, and stay happy, for both of us. Huh? Hey, no loitering, you drunk! Mm -hmm. Hey, who were you babbling to just now? Oh, uh, sorry. Didn't mean to make a scene or anything. Huh? <laughs> you wasted, big guy? Maybe you need to walk down to the station. Uh, no, officer. No need for that. I was just about to leave. Yeah? Well, I suggest you get on home. Don't be a nuisance. Okay. <laughs> Maybe we'll meet again. When it's my time. Thank <laughs> you.